It's to my benefit. Nice. The will to receive supports it because it's beneficial. From this point and on, a different kind of work begins. Serving the Creator, the Creator's work, where I have to subjugate myself toward the appropriate environment. This is truly considered free choice working in free choice. I can remain in the same state as I was up until now. None else besides him, the good that does good in its beastly form, or through the correction to continue in correcting the broken Kli, meaning I come out of my own individuality into connection. And this this already is the wisdom. Here is where it begins the wisdom of Kabbalah because we're talking here about the correction of Adam Rishon. And why does the Rabash begin all of his articles with that? From this point and on, it's really the wisdom of Kabbalah. Religion comes to an end and begins the wisdom of Kabbalah in practice. That we're not talking about the after the like in the UN and in plenty of other places, you have nice speeches, but that in practice you have to get organized in a ten. That you have nine friends that you subjugate yourself to and you elevate them to the degree of the Creator. Of course and what you can and you work in such a way where you start feeling how much each and every moment you really subjugate your ego toward them and how much the Creator is doing the opposite work on you that in your eyes they seem more ignoble lowly you see them as such attributes that you see in them such qualities that even on the street you can't find stuff like that it's not that you discover them because you know them better or something you know people at work too but it's revealed to you as something unbelievable how the creator gathered all the wicked in one place it's really so what are you laughing about? Now you agree, right? And this is where the work starts. So, now after the Bulgarian Congress, this is what we have to start with. And also you yourselves have to feel that we're really going into the spiritual work. Not like it used to be, that we're in states of none else besides him, the good that does good, um, and it's corporeal phase, but now... If you can be a little bit more accurate, suppose till now we ascribed everything to there's none else besides him and the good and benevolent individually, what, what is the addition now? Um, that I do not want to attribute it to myself, but I want it to pass to me through the ten. Opposite work. To the benefit of the Creator, but through, through the ten. And then you're really directed toward Him, because He, for you, becomes the one that exists within the Tetrishonot. And the work of ascribing the person does, he hands it as a gift to the ten. He wants, he doesn't want anything. He wants only to elevate them, only to elevate them to the Creator in order to give him contentment. So, what happens is that the Tetrishonot is the Kli, that this is where he arranges them, elevates them to the Creator, and the Creator who's in the Tetrishonot gets pleasure. And man himself doesn't want nothing, Tzimtzum, only Ochozel. And in that, the more he makes Tzimtzum and Ochozel, he feels that he's really in a second nature. Let's hope that toward 
It's a big Congress. We will already be in that somehow.